All right, how you doing, YouTube? Stan here with another video. Another video for the 22 update truck videos. This time we have the 22 Denali, so it's not the Denali Ultimate. So if you're one of those guys that's looking for your traditional Denali trim, this is the truck here behind me. So we're gonna go over a few of the differences. If you wanna see a Denali Ultimate, I'll link the video down in the comments down below and a link on YouTube so you can check out a Denali Ultimate but let's go ahead and get into the video. So finishing up some portions of the video and I wanted to put a disclaimer out there. The audio and some of the portions of this video might not be the best. So please don't crucify me in the co comments. This was just an impromptu video. So I just want to throw that out there before you get into the rest of it. But now let's get to it. Give this video a thumbs up. All right, YouTube. So we're going to start on the exterior of the truck. Um, something that's obviously going to be different in every refresh that they do on, on a Denali on the CR 1500s in general, it's typically gonna be the grill. So this is something that they've obviously changed, giving you a little bit more detail throughout. Kind of a traditional, typical Denali chrome grill. So this is something that a lot of customers are still gonna want. That's something that they gave us there. Kind of following the same trend, um, we get a new rim. It's still a 22 inch rim. It's actually a really nice refresh. They've given us the chrome accents. The center caps are also chrome in the same way. Really good looking wheel. You're going to keep the same running board for the Denali. Um, this is actually going to slide out and slide back for bed access. So it does both. Moving kind of back to the corner here, they give us the same cornering bumper step. Obviously, having a step is nice. And then following the same trend of stuff that they keep on the Denali is going to be the multi-pro tailgate. Obviously, everybody wants that on these now. That kind of wrap up, wraps up kind of the differences that we see from the Denali, Denali Ultimate, and then from obviously the 22 Limiteds to the 22s. All right, so if you follow my channel a bit or you're watching any of the uh, new truck videos, that was Anthony. He uh, helps me out with my videos, so I figured I'd give him a little screen time and let him do a little bit uh, on this new Denali Ultimate. But what we're gonna do, we're gonna go ahead, hop in the truck. That's where you're gonna spend most of your time. That's what you wanna see. Like he said, the Denali is more of a traditional Denali look. The Ultimate, they changed it up. They want to give you some features that makes that truck really, really unique. And not to say that this truck isn't unique, but it's more of what you're used to seeing from Denali's from a decade ago, as far as, you know, just the, the look that they have. But like I said, we're going to go ahead and get into the interior. So like I said, we're going to get into the interior of this new truck. Uh, the Denali, this is the reserve package. so. It doesn't have all the Denali Ultimate accents. We're gonna keep saying that because we want you to know the differences, but it's still an upgrade from your 21 or your 22 Limited Denali. Uh, it still has some good uh, stitching detail here on the uh, armrest, and you still get a good badge that says Denali on there versus uh, Denali Ultimate AT4X or AT4. AT4X video coming soon, so y'all keep that in mind. But you got your Bose speakers. Uh, you're going to have plenty of them spread out all throughout the truck. Um, this one uh, does come equipped with Super Cruise. So it's not on right now, so you can't really see it. But this truck does have Super Cruise. You can get that on the reserve. Now, I will be honest with you, with the parts constraints that GM is suffering from, uh, we, we as a dealership, as well as General Motors and additional dealerships, probably won't be able to get you Super Cruise in a normal, uh, your standard reserve Denali currently. This truck was ordered in January. It's now May. Uh, this truck just showed up and it has Super Cruise still equipped. This one is also a four wheel drive truck. Um, so you have your controls, very similar placement to what uh, the previous interior had. Heads up display, it's gonna be up there in the glass like I said, the truck's not on, so you can't really see it. Uh, but the biggest thing that everybody really, really loves is the new uh, screen that you have on these trucks. So the screen, 
like we've uh, said previously in other videos, is a big upgrade that everyone was happy to see. Um, I'm glad to see it. It's transitioned uh, pretty smoothly across all the trucks. Like in the Yukons, they've got a different setup, like, you know, a higher screen, an embedded screen, a screen that kind of pokes out. But in the trucks, they didn't really go for that, which is kind of a good thing. It's all more uniform across the board. Uh, a big thing that I like is a piano key setup. That's something that Cadillac kind of has with your uh, climate control buttons kind of in the middle. You got your electronic position precision shifter here that um, is kind of new for trucks, for General Motors. Ford has had something similar to this. Dodge has their nice little dial uh, and G GM made the transition, but it kind of gives you a traditional, almost a sporty feel with that uh, shifter right there. I also wanted to let you know, it does have the camera mirror and we'll turn the truck on in a second because I do want you to kind of see how it looks with everything lit up. Sunroof, this truck has a jet black interior. So along with the black exterior um, on this truck, which is Onyx black, you do get your jet black interior um, with the Denali accenting. Now I will say something that somebody might be wanting to know is this interior is not as detailed as what the Denali Ultimate is. That's really where the money difference is in the Denali Ultimate. Uh, besides the visual things you can kind of tell on the exterior, the interior is a big, big difference. And it's not that this isn't good. This is just more of what you're used to. So honestly, you might be kind of... Um, numb to it because you've seen it so much this is you know almost the exact same seat setup that's in the 21s and your 22 limiteds whereas here like i said in the denali ultimate i should uh, say there's a lot more detail uh the headliners different and things like that so that's just really what we wanted to point out as far as the interior is concerned and we'll go back here to the second row like anthony said your power steps do come out uh just like they are here with the doors open and you know good seat spacing here nothing's changed um, as far as that's concerned so really you say what's the difference in the interior uh, the cab design and layout was really really well put together but we really needed to see some uh, upgrades here in your technology so you probably seen these videos of these new trucks the Denali they didn't drop the ball on that either another good thing I want to show you guys I gotta get up in here. Something that I like a whole bunch is how this dash. So with all your tech here, everything's got nice black accents. Uh, they didn't change that. But then what they did is a nice little transition or fade over to your wood grain that matches everything that's on the door. Uh, they did it pretty smooth. Nothing too crazy, nothing too out of the, out of, you know, an eyesore. And that's what you get here. And I really, really like that. And I wanted to point that out in my video as well. All right, so we'll close out this video. I appreciate you guys for watching. Shout out to my man Anthony back there helping me out with the video. I don't usually have help with these videos. Uh, and him and Matthew, they've really been helping me out, so I appreciate that. But if you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to the channel. I have to finish up this kind of series uh, with the AT4X, but I'm also gonna do the Elevation, the SLT, just when we get these trucks, the first ones we get. I'm gonna make sure I drop a video because I feel like my videos, I can give you a different view from the traditional reviewers. Uh, but like Anthony said, uh, the details on the Denali versus the Denali Ultimate, they're a little bit different. More of what you're looking for every single day on your Denali, and you can save a little bit of money, which I know everybody wants to do. So like I said, if you like this video, uh, like it, drop a comment. I appreciate you guys for watching. Have a good day, and that's it.